Welcome to the video where we'd like to show you how you can remotely mount your LCP on the outside of an air handling unit. We've developed a LCP remote mounting kit that comes in a white box like this and when you open it, it consists of a lid like this. You can open it. There's a blind cover that you mount on your drive instead of your LCP. There's a knob with a gasket that goes at the back of the air handling unit and there is a cradle like this and has a connector here going from sub D9 to an M12 connector at the back. In the bottom of the kit, or the box, you have a cable. These come in 3, 6 and 10 meter cables. One end is on an angle that goes on the drive and the other end goes in the cradle. And there's a small tool that will help you disassemble everything again. So this is an air handling unit wall and you need to drill a 24 millimeter hole in the wall. And this fits with the, uh, the cradle. The cradle is clearly marked with an up. You make sure that this is upwards and then you put it through the air handling unit wall like this. At the back, you take your knob, make sure the gasket is on the inside and the studs is going into the wall. Mounted like this, and this needs to be tightened with a torque of 1.5 Newton meters. And this keeps the IP54 rating of the unit. So like this. If needed, you can also add four self-tapping screws in either corner of the cradle. These do not come with the set, but uh, you can use any kind you like. The next thing you do is that you take your LCP from the drive and you mount it into the cradle. So here we have our LCP taken out of the drive with a gasket around it. We mount this into the drive and make sure that the top is fastened behind the small holder in the, in the, uh, in the cradle. Then we take our lid, we mount it at the top like this and press it downwards until we hear two clicking sounds like this, and now it's mounted. The lid can be left fully open for programming, and it can also be set like a little roof where it provides shade for the LCP, so uh, it's kept out of direct sunlight. It has three holes, so you can see if the drive is on, if there's a warning, or if there is an alarm. At the back, you take your cable, and you make sure you take the, the straight connector, and this goes into the cradle kit like this and should be fastened just like that. This is an IP66 connector so it can handle uh, some moisture in the air. The blind cover you need to mount in the drive. You remove the cap from the front where you have your connector like this and you mount it into the drive. This has a gasket around it, so this is for an IP55 unit, but you can also remove the gasket and, and put it into an IP20 unit. Put it into the drive like that and make sure you put the lid back on. The cable with an angle at the end goes into the unit at the drive and is fastened using the screws at the end of the cable. And now you have remotely mounted your LCP on the outside of an air handling unit. At the bottom of the front, you have a small eye at the bottom and you can mount a padlock so you can prevent unauthorized access to the unit. If you want to remove the front, you need to open it like this and you use the disassembly tool. You click that into the two small holes at the bottom and you must hear two clicking sounds, in either, one in either side, like this, there, and you can remove the front, like that and exchange the LCP or remove the unit or whatever is needed.